Hi everybody and hi Amanda. Hi everybody. Hi Catherine. Hi and welcome back to the second episode of What, what the Talk. talk. Ah, <laughs> we're we live, baby. Second episode. <laughs> second episode. We made it to episode two. We didn't die. Mm, not yet. We still here. <laughs> <laughs> we're going strong. Mm. All right. So how was your week? How are you? I'm good. I mean, you know, you've seen me at work. Barely. Yeah, barely. Half of the week. We, <laughs> but we had Chris. You know, it was Christmas time. Oh, no. No, I did Christmas. I mean, what do you mean? Oh, it is Christmas. It is Christmas. Okay, but when you'll be hearing this, it'll be past. Yeah, Christmas. yeah. But yeah, it's, it was, they were giving crappy food and then. Be grateful. It, uh, okay, I guess. I'm grateful for the crappy food. <laughs> I and can't. the sweets, bruh. When I told you I went in and them sweets? The sweets were good. No, but yesterday. Oh, you weren't there? No. Girl, they had a whole table. Nice. I got a few pounds, <laughs> but it's okay. It's the holiday. It's the holiday. How was your week? It was, it was. <laughs> <laughs> that's how it was. <laughs> you know what? We're not even going to comment on that. <laughs> yeah, that's how it was. That that's how my week was. But yeah, like you said, it's the holidays. Everything is allowed. And then January first, everybody's gonna be at the gym. And by January fifteenth, everybody's at the gym. You, you, <laughs> we you give them up. that long? We can't Bro, keep January second day out. <laughs> nah, come on, give them a little bit of time. Okay, I'm speaking for myself then. <laughs> But today in this episode, Mm -hmm. our topic today is cultural differences, diversity, diversity. How could you not get this right? Because because I can never, you know, I keep getting them confused. Like they're all the same to me. But before we even get to that, like I have like some advice for you guys. Okay. I'm feeling like, you know, like preachy. Is that for me or for everybody? No, for everybody. Okay. All the listeners. It's something that I learned. Like I knew, but you know when you know stuff and then they come they come pop into you and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. So this week reminded me of it was really cold, okay? So yeah. it reminded me of <clears throat> how you know the seasons in life, like how there's winter, summer, there's four seasons. They in five? No, there's four seasons. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where you are. There's four seasons. Okay. Everybody, don't get it twisted. It's, I'm teasing you. Yeah, five teasing seasons psych. is a show. It's four seasons. <laughs> you know, like the hotel. But just like the four seasons, like uh, winter, summer, whatever the other ones are. Fall, fall and spring. spring. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So just because, and we should look at the seasons like we look at our lives. In life, sometimes you are going through some things, and it is like rocky or it is cold or it is dark just know it is the winter season Mm -hmm. and summer's coming soon like wherever you are right now like it's not gonna stay forever like it's gonna it's gonna go to something else like it's 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 just like progressing exactly and then it goes back and forth back and forth back and forth like winter comes it's gonna go and it's gonna come again and it's gonna go it's just part of living and growing or whatever but know that if we don't have spring we can't have summer yeah you know you have to go through those things exactly and i think that forms our character (laughs) yeah that's what that matters at the end of the day (laughs) but yeah did you like my advice yeah, it was very inspiring. <laughs> <laughs> but fun fact, okay, fun fact. I have fun facts too, because okay. you know I'm mad, mad corny. Oh so did gosh. you know that fish sleep with their eyes open? It really, happens. No. <laughs> I have a better one. Okay, birds don't pee. Shit, I wish I was like that. <laughs> you don't think that's funny? Yeah. Okay, but- I have a, I have a better one. I have a better one. Alligators cannot. Put their tongues out, bruh. Yeah, you're kidding me. They have tongues. You, you, do you they can you, have you ever seen an alligator tongue? They can, like, you know, I just saw the teeth, right? Exactly, because, like, their tongues they can't chew, so, so they they're just that swallow. powerful, yeah. So, and we need tongues. Fun facts. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have a better one because Amanda's not liking these. I have a, I have a tricky one, okay. Before I was, 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 <laughs> is. <laughs> I love that one. (laughs) 
<laughs> but for the ones that don't understand, dwell on it. <laughs> <laughs> the French version. What's the French version? I think it was before. Uh, Avant, it 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 Okay. <laughs> Enough of that. <laughs> Enough of fun facts. But listen. But now we're gonna talk about the topic of the day. Yeah. What is it? It's a topic that I, you guys like. Listen, I'm not racist, but <laughs> let's talk about. It. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> let's talk about not being racist. Let's talk about because, it. Because guys, I have been having a problem. Okay. What is it, girl? I cannot relate to white people. Okay. What, what do you mean? Do you not resonate with them because they're white or you don't resonate? It doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother you. White man. girls' tears don't... It don't mean shit. Well, this closer, <laughs> my co-host Catherine is not racist, okay? <laughs> no, I, I, I feel like I'm not. I don't think I'm racist. I'm not racist. But that's how I feel. Like, okay. I feel like... Like, is like extra. Like, they, they just. Like, see my example, the person might know who I'm talking about, but. <laughs> it's like, okay. <laughs> People, Haitians are gonna know who I'm referring to. Oh, damn. <laughs> but it's like, okay. You living with the person. Mm hmm. I'm, I'm actually going to quote somebody else. Shout okay. out to Nora. Okay? okay. So I have this girl named Nora that I do her hair sometimes. Okay. By the way, guys, I do hair. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out Ca- to me. Cat slay, cat slay. <laughs> so I do her hair sometimes and we were discussing it and mm-hmm. she goes to all white school. Well, mm-hmm. mostly maybe. And she's like, yo, cat, like when they're mad, mm-hmm. everybody's mad. Like, their little problems is like, the whole yeah it's like if i'm not having a good day i'm gonna come in and not say hi to you because i'm having a bad day and but everybody has to have though. a bad day i'm not white <laughs> you, you are kind of white though <laughs> but serious note though i think what you're experiencing is not racism it's not like you do not like white people i don't think yeah, that i don't if I don't, you see what a white person get rid of you're just gonna run over it too so no you, no i'm not, not gonna like do that. that but it's but like i think you're experiencing cultural diversity <sighs> and a lot of people mistake that for Maybe. racism but what would racism be though? Because I feel like I'm not racist. Okay. I know I'm not in pa- Like I don't feel like I'm better than them or something. So, so isn't that what racism is? Yeah, like racism is like against someone based on their race, on their belief, or their They're their skin. race is superior. Okay, like based on skin color. Yeah, or something like, like that. because <laughs> you don't have a pointy nose, mm-hmm. you don't matter to me. Like you're irrelevant. This world needs to go on pass you okay like, you don't matter i don't i don't feel like no, that about you're not them. like that i know you ain't racist you work <laughs> with white people <laughs> oh i don't mean nothing <laughs> they work for me yeah so but i'm going to but i feel like it's the diversity like the cultural diversity which is like the quality yeah, of, of diversity and different culture merging into one room yeah i can't relate and as opposed of monoculture but we'll get into that another time okay because I, I it's like to tell you, I can't relate. Yeah. It's like, I, they, they break up with their girlfriends and they're crying, their boyfriends and they're crying or whatever. And it's like, uh, it, yeah, like, I can't relate. But a white girl come, a, a, a black girl come and they're like, girl, this, this, that, that. Or like a Haitian girl comes, mm-hmm. I would even go there. Like, I feel it more. I understand it more. Because I, I know Haitian men and all these yeah. things like that, you know? Exactly. You heard what you said. Okone, that's why I sing. Yeah. But if a um, um, black woman come to cry about a white man, what do you so up here? Like, right? For like, what? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> like, what was the reason? Oh, he, he, he didn't cook for me. You know, like something banal, but yeah. it's, it's big to them, but I just can't relate. My mom, it just doesn't resonate to me. Yeah. That's how I feel. But I see what you mean though, because now that you say the culture difference thing, mm-hmm. it is, it is a big deal because when, when you're looking at it, like even us hate Haitians, mm-hmm. we have culture difference amongst oh. ourselves. Yeah. Even inside of Haiti, there's so many like Muno Kap pa fe manje mem jarek, Moun Moun Latibonit pa fe manje jarek, Mem Muno Kap. Shout out, shout out to my people, Latibonit. Okay. You're from Latibonit? Where my parents are. So, <laughs> anyways, I don't know anything about them really, but. Well, I know. <laughs> Let me guess. Your first salad is some potato. Well, excuse me. Disclosure here. Disclosure. Disclosure. 
Je ne fais pas une salade de betterave. Et au moins que tu fais tout le monde, malgré les balas, salade russe. Guys, Amanda swore to me that salade russe has no potato. I don't know. I came to Captain's house because Captain made some bomb ass. Okay, sorry, I said ass. Bomb ass salads. Like, she does macaroni salad, salade russe. And then I saw it had potato, and I'm like, why? She's like, my mother don't put potato in it. I'm like, girl, then it's not salad with. You don't have salad with for the potato salad. Everybody got their own recipe. Maybe my mom was trying to be carb less. <laughs> creative. <laughs> you know, creative. She was trying you to put her last bunny touch in it. But some of my mom got last bunny bars. I see the mom now. <laughs> but seriously, even in our little country, there's mm-hmm. so many diversity. Yeah. There's so many differences within ourselves. Exactly. And inside of all culture, there's culture in Taku. Uet kafu gon culture and dans la kayo gon lot culture. Yeah. And it's like and dans la kayo with the parents, yeah, there's so another culture. It's like so many between frères and sœurs. There's, there's another culture. Culture pool. Yeah. It's like it's, it's crazy. Like, it's 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 much, so much bigger than us. Mm. But even like now we're talking about the food, but there's so many yeah. others. Like, like mm. a woman that's from Haiti mm-hmm. and a girl that's from like emotionally, right? Okay. We talked about emotional abuse last time. Yeah. If you guys didn't didn't hear it, go back and listen to emotion yeah. episode one, yeah. emotional abuse. It mm-hmm. was some good stuff. So you know how we talked about emotional abuse last time? Yeah. And then it all comes to the culture as well. Because yeah, of course. if you're from Haiti you feel things a certain way when you come here you the, the things you hear these girls these haitian girls yeah. here complaining about it's like what the hell are you complaining about oh people about? like are promoting like oh emotional views when people in haiti are actually living in this and this is the uh no the their, reality. Normal, their reality exactly. like their you know norm. it's like what you talking about emotional views this is how we talk to each other <laughs> like franchement like abuse yeah you know like Word hurt me. <laughs> I don't have space for words to hurt yeah. me because I'm hungry at the moment. But you know? I, f- I feel like Jean did like cultural diversity. Come see, on I think he went to Haiti and you went to Canada or Etats-Unis or France. Mm-hmm. It's like nous même we're so focused on you know we have the perf we don't have a perfect life but our life is better mm-hmm. come see we don't have to worry what we got to eat the next day. Exactly. So some of us. Some of us. Some of us. Mm-hmm. generalized. Mm-hmm. But it's like. Because I don't have to worry about what I, I I pick on little things that I wouldn't notice if exactly. I was in a, something on Google. Exactly, you know. You have time for other things now. Now that the hunger's out of it, uh, let's see I how. I got feelings. Let's see how Amanda made me feel today. Oh my gosh, <laughs> you know how yeah. emotional I get <laughs> before I start crying. <laughs> but that's like for the emotion, mm-hmm. emotional stuff though. Like there's so much more. Like come they got a woman, mm-hmm. a Haitian woman in. Canada, like sim society, you're not woman enough for me. Girl, don't even get me started with this frustration I'm dealing with right <laughs> now because I think we were having a conversation earlier mm-hmm. and I'm not going to say who it was because <laughs> I was frustrated. <laughs> but it's just like to say like for the Haitian community, I'm not Haitian enough or I'm not even Haitian at all. Yeah. And then for the Canadian community, a community, sorry. Mm-hmm. I'm not Canadian. Yeah. And then I'm just in the gray. I'm not even gray. I'm just not there. If I'm in Haitian, not a cool Haitian woman. Yeah. I'm not a Haitian woman. 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 I'm not a Haitian Culture yeah. different, you know. Culture. They're gonna judge you on the way that you about to feed your husband because they're gonna say, "I'm not happy being by my little manger." Exactly. On joue moins à Marie McCann, McDonald's pour bien supper. Not knowing that it's a culture sure, difference. Different. For you, that's okay because in your culture, it's acceptable. But in ours, bah, ça va accepter. Et même j'ont te dit, like in the beginning of the conversation, on te dit, like, non, kai moun comme sou gen kyo tu pa, madame Amari gen kyo ti ti moun a maman a papa. They have their own culture. Mm-hmm. So I think that's how we have to start accepting one another's culture, mm-hmm. but at the same time embrace the differentness. I don't even know if that's the mm-hmm. it <laughs> makes word. sense. It makes sense. I yeah. see what you mean. Like embrace it. Like when maybe I don't make my salad grease with potato, mm-hmm. you might not like it. What about is it? Be memory. 
<laughs> yeah, or come on air and judge you for yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> but you know, I like both of them. You know. Yeah. Yeah. So at the end of the day, I need to start like loving it, appreciating it, mm-hmm. because nous tout humain. Exactly. Okay? And even with my thing that I was telling you, I'm not racist, but it bothered me a lot because I felt like tant coup li pa humain pour moi. Okay. Because if you come to me crying and I can't resonate, you know, yeah. I can't show, even show empathy. Do I even consider you as a human? Mm. You know, so that's when I had to tell tell myself like, yo, you have to do issue. better. Yeah, you know, because humans are humans. But how did you do with it? Like I'm still able to deal with it. Petit, petit, I'm still, I'm still not capable. I feel like, but it's I'm your trying. environment, though. You have to diversify your environment. Oh my God, you know me, I'm saying, I'm not capable to deal with it. I'm sorry. Oh, même si, même si, if you have to circle yourself with the white Haitian, because gay and white Haitian, they don't too. get the jokes, though. Like I hate when I tell you a joke and I have to explain the, the joke. You see, joke club, I make sense. Est-ce qu'on t'en débarrasse, ça, Catherine? Ou vous voulez dans même box, man? I get it. Sometimes we have to step out of a comfort zone. Ou toujours, dis-moi ça qu'on va parler. Yeah, when it comes to the blancs, on met dans la comfort zone. <laughs> Everything else, you could step out. You know, <laughs> it's like, I'm not going to bring be, uh, Becky boys to the video. <laughs> Becky's our new best friend, our white best friend. <laughs> on Quebec was pure, you know, something. But it's, it's just like, I feel like if we could like, you know, from work, from time to time, we talk to Arab, blonde, mm-hmm. all the stuff is different. We have we can have a different mindset on certain things. Yeah, 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 I see. What we you can mean. build little micro. I don't want to say large relationship, but little micro relationship relationship, so we can have that diversity within mm-hmm. ourselves. So we can understand, like, okay, les blancs manger avec. I don't know. Sans, sans sel, sans sel, sans poivre. I get it. It's your culture. Mm-hmm. But let's even like I went to like manger bondi collé à poire. Mm-hmm. He's like, wow. Like I didn't know rice could be made this way. Exactly. Yeah. Like, okay. So if I never introduce them or I ever open the door for them, there's no way people could get to there's know no growth that part of the culture. You and, understand yeah, what I'm saying? Exactly. So if we start just opening the door and I mm-hmm. put up a wall and be like, oh, Amanda va faire du la sel, il va rentrer faire manger. Do not come to my house. Exactly. Amanda will never know that du could even have Sell. Exactly. We can, we have to stop putting barriers in segregation. Like we, you know, let's go back in history a little bit. Mm-hmm. We always talk about oh, there was the black versus white. Mm-hmm. What did we fight so well for? For us to be able to be sitting in a room with white and black. But once we got in the room, now we want to be the back. The blacks here, the whites here. We don't mix. What was the point of all this? <laughs> but you know it's like i feel like we need like, as a people we need to put the because they're very welcoming not all of them but the people I that are you freak on but you know we we are a world with who who is perfect yeah you know we're not perfect so it's like we we both we, we both were have, boastful we think we're the best like we did we are though shit but we were the first back nation we still carrying that thing where what are the we talk? <laughs> shit we, we are we think we are the ish and nobody could tell us nothing but think about it if everybody had that same mindset like I'm the ish mm-hmm. where would we go yeah, we're the plan. We're just revolving around in circles. Exactly. No fine. We don't grow. We don't exchange mm-hmm. like we're doing right now. We're exchanging because whether we like it or not, when say Aisen, who say Aisen, but you're native natal. So at the end of the day, we're so different. Even though we're both Haitian, yeah. when my mom and dad can't relate on a lot of things. A lot. You know, <laughs> that's what we're doing. What the talk? You know, we can't relate on a lot of things. And the beauty of this whole talking thing is because I respect her and mm-hmm. she respects me as exactly. well. And then new show understanding for both of our things. She understands where I come from and I try to Not understand all the time, where she comes Let's from. Let's be real. I try. <laughs> <laughs> I try to, but I like sometimes, sometimes she really has to break it down for me to get it because, yeah. like we said, cultural just, differences. Breaking down uh, takes a long time, you know. When you're in blanc. Yeah, I had to break it down a lot, but at least I feel like the fact that you're Haitian, mm-hmm. it makes it easier for me to break yeah. it down for you because blanc, you talk, you pas get it, okay, you pas get it, I move on. Yeah, you know it's like I don't have the energy for my sister, my best to go side because cut so back I can't Yeah, I feel like. Come see my I have like a little I like I I haven't seen the reality of what you guys lived through, mm-hmm. but I seen like what's it like ti comedy ti by style like me the media I see what it is so like that I got a glimpse into your reality, but like that at the same time blonde they only see what they see on TV Haitian keep poor got money for donation that's all they see so 
Exactly. So it's like I, as long as we know the change, we we start it with ourselves. You know, mm-hmm. I start, you start, you do your part. I become a little more welcoming, and you keep doing you and even better. Mm-hmm. And then at the end of the day, we don't know everything. So exactly, day we're by day, we're gonna learn. You know, we're gonna understand someone's culture can also benefit like our health because mm-hmm. like you know, so, yeah, like you know that. Shout out, <laughs> shout out to that. <laughs> that cures everything. Everything. I can't everything. believe. I'm mm. saying that even mental illness. I think. I saw the mask that I'm wearing. Vale, the mask that I'm wearing. I saw a meme. I saw a meme that says "men mental illness." Men is short for mental illness. Hold <laughs> <laughs> on, let me step on that. So you know, I should just pull the mask that I'm wearing. Not that the men I'm wearing for mental illness. The guys are all just on focus. But that's for another day. <laughs> Next episode. <laughs> <laughs> But say something, so I can say women are saying that we have a mm-hmm. lot of people could learn from it. I remember I lived with this white girl for a while, mm-hmm. and then she was sick, and then I did, I made tea for her. I made ginger tea. For te je jam pouli te je jam na was strong. And passe lui masque tea na fonli. You got to name it. Yeah, she was she was turning red, but mm-hmm. she was like. I, She woke up the next day and she felt better. Like she took okay. a shower, she felt better. She was like, "Oh my god, you're like a mother. Aww. You took care of me and stuff." And I'm like, "This is like regular Haitian shit. What you talking about? Like, oh my god, what's your mask to do me? No, 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 no I'm sure there's a lot of things that she has in her culture that I could learn from as well. And if I don't just put my my ego down and don't think that I know everything, she'll never get to that part, you know? Yeah, and diversity, like, by us, like, like, exchanging and everything it creates like innovation differences yeah we create like me and you could come together and create a machine i'm not saying we're gonna create a machine now but why not you know, why not well, you know, <laughs> next project <laughs> but the perspective it helps us to you know we exchange and we learn how to to exchange things yeah and we get better at it that's the that's the goal that's the goal we're trying to say at the end of the day it's respect understanding and appreciate my culture and if you see that i'm happy doing whatever the hell i'm doing be happy for my happiness exactly because if i'm happy in my skin what's the what's what what's not to love like somebody generally genuinely whatever the word is Mm. happy Like, why wouldn't you appreciate my happiness? But you know, we got haters out here. But why? Why wouldn't you love me being me? Why wouldn't you love me being my authentic self and just exactly. me being un, like not poor moi? You know, let's say that we marry la caillou and when we're que we pas by manjo, pas by ma ou manger at twelve o'clock, at seven a.m., mm-hmm. at three p.m. You know, you don't do these things, but you guys are happy with it. But you that's know? the thing, though. So why shouldn't I? Why wouldn't I be happy for you that it works for your marriage? Why have mm. shita la ma hate on it? The, what's bad is just you're not happy. If you're not happy like, in your relationship, that's what should concern me. If you're happy, yeah. I should be freaking happy. Yeah, that be you're happy. happy for me. Be happy for me. Like like we said, like from our differences, we need to have acceptance. Exactly. Like I could be different. What could be working for me and my husband cannot be working for you because we're two different couples. Cap try to live up a standard, you mm-hmm. know, from when Cap is the beast. I it's better if I'm myself exactly you know? but at the same time mm. you if you could like like you talked about I'm not serving my husband food mm-hmm. let's say I wasn't aware that I wasn't doing it because sometimes we do stuff and we don't realize we're so busy exactly. and go 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 get it mm-hmm. but sometimes we can we can talk to each other that's where the yeah. point of sharing and being exactly. open-minded comes when I see you do that I'd be like oh if I if I shak midi seto by manje you do that in your culture mm. you'd be like yeah girl this is the reason why I do that if I some bullshit like yeah. oh Simba fell marry my kitim no because mm. we already know we can't keep a nigga with these things yeah Yeah, you, you know? there's no recipe on you keeping a nigga. Mm-hmm. Let's keep it clear. 100. Yeah. <laughs> Parce que ay say old gen de fois yo dis konsa ou lever ou fè manger ou ranger cabane ou mete de l'eau pour les sleep nigga. Passer chemisette li, I mean old diva. You know and he's never gonna go anywhere. Mm-hmm. And then on jou lever ou tande li gen trois petites Haiti. Like if it's a pied là, it's not even trois petites nigga là. Sometimes he go out and cheat with Omo and keep on. Même fait ça, keep on. Même bam. 
Je vais mettre des choses en dehors. You know? Like, like, like on monde qui 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 pas même do none of yeah. these things mm-hmm. et puis ou est e avec là les ça exactly. veut dire this, there's no recipe on how to keep a man Le, when i'm doing these little things for my culture is because i'm doing it it makes me happy, happy. it makes my ha- husband happy you could ask me cat i see you do that why and i could tell you this is why i do that mm-hmm. you know I, i understand how he's tired so mit manje pour lui and he does this thing for me exactly yeah. that he does this that's my way of yeah. showing him that and that's his love language whatever yeah. that's what i, I want to cater to my man exactly and, and then you could say you could see mm, that doesn't work for me because that's not my man's love language yeah. you know and you and could say too. i'm gonna keep whatever the hell i'm doing because it's working for me or you could say oh i'm gonna try that next time and yeah. see how it makes it better expose ourselves to new things exactly you know because yes. we all know it all nigga. cat i feel like we were saying so many things Girl, I sure did. We might as well be the psychologist. Yeah, man, damn, we're going to be the psychologist. Ah, when you come, we're going to be the But that's the thing. The culture, cultural diversity. diversity. That, yes. That's, that's the point. There's diversity in the culture. It's beautiful with the diversity. Yes. The culture won't be itself if it's just diversity. mono, whatever. It's our differences that makes us who we yeah, are yeah. like you as know? a society and i feel like when i think about the word diversity i feel like it's full of color exactly it's like wow like you know when you see the rainbow you see all those colors that mm-hmm. come together and they create a rainbow one yes yeah or one or something that makes it so beautiful within the difference mm-hmm. they all stand out differently exactly it's not because i i'm white you're black i can't stand out we can't mm-hmm. coexist exactly we can't coexist we can move forward with respect understanding and you know show empathy empathy and be happy, happy for me be happy happy to you know, happiness happiness <laughs> <laughs> Rien down, like happiness. you know. As long as I'm happy, be, Simone, be happy, happy for my happiness. <laughs> <laughs> Don't call me, but yeah, me. that's the whole vibe. Yeah, so <sighs> that man, <laughs> we had one deep breath for that. But to summarize <laughs> all, all of that, that, we just said, yeah. At the end of the day, guys, respect each other's sure. cultures, mm-hmm. and within ourselves, there's there are cultural differences. With within a group of friends, there are, there are cultural differences. Exactly. And it don't don't judge me based on something. Nobody's wrong. Nobody's right. There's no right way of doing anything. Yeah, you know, there's, there's no, no there's no like a book that says this is right. You must do, do it, it this that way. way. You know, yeah. it's whatever works for you. So believe number one, Jay. If it's an accord, ta kuli an accord avec bon Dieu. Your, your beliefs. Your beliefs even better. Mm. If it's an accord avec Bilifu. Do, go ahead. Do you and me uh, on the outside that's looking at it. Learn to be happy for me and appreciate me and respect whatever yeah. I'm doing because and, I'm happy doing it. And and little piece of advice, you know, since we're ending this mm-hmm. right now, for this week, try to entertain or have a a conversation with someone you never had. It doesn't have to have the, they don't have to have something similar. Just try to engage with different people. That's gonna be hard for me. Well, try. I'm, I want to hear what you got on Instagram, <laughs> on Facebook, on Snapchat, Twitter. Twitter. I'm still back and figure out Twitter at some Girl, I've been on it all week. They, I did not know there was such a good community. <laughs> really? They lit. Like, I'm missing out then. Girl, Instagram ain't got, like, Twitter ain't got nothing. Wait. Instagram ain't got nothing on Twitter? Yeah. Oh, my God. Like, that. they're really on it. Like, Twitter, like, Instagram, you know, people pick pictures to, to, to show their lives. Your best selves. Twitter show the rawness. Okay? That's nice. I like it. Really? Yeah. Then follow what but the talk. What the talk. Five oh nine. Because you know we keeping it creep. <laughs> <laughs> Always Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Pod- Spotify, Apple Podcasts, yeah. and tune in for our next episodes every Wednesday. Wednesday. And look for the clues. Yeah. Because we we keep asking y'all what's the next topic, and if you have topics for me and Catherine to discuss, mm-hmm. you can suggestions. Suggestion, suggestion. Oh my gosh! Exactly. <laughs> Whatever I'm in the show, I say it's more. No comprend. No comprend. No comprend. Creole, no comprend. Creole, parler, creole, comprend. I can never see that. But it's okay. <laughs> but shout out to um, Free Thai Lakai mm-hmm. in Montreal. We're gonna give a shout out to Fanny Milly. You guys could go follow her on Instagram every mm-hmm. Saturday. She has. If I buy Free Thai, sans sell by nonsense. No. Bon Free Thai. Bon Piclis. Piclis. Pick 
cannot join. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> la bon, bon. Ba mm. ça veut dire chaque eh, vendredi chaque samedi, samedi soir, soir. Every, Friday, every Saturday night um her the pictures gonna be the flyers on on her page is gonna be on our page as well mm -hmm. you call the number you order your free thai mm -hmm. and then you come pick it up it's it gonna be hot hot and ready and grub on yes eat up <laughs> you know but is support the unit right that's the beauty of the song eh? yeah I mean, okay, that's a wrap. We all right. See you so, next week, Amanda. See you next week. All right, that's it. Peace out. Peace and out. this has been What, what the, the Talk. talk. <laughs> what the talk, what the talk.